Why I live a life of crime? What kind of question is that, man? I wouldn't call it the life of crime. I, I call it the life of survival. I don't call it living a life of crime. I live call it, you know, living a life in this time, you dig? It's the life that we live. Y'all niggas look at it like crime. People get born on top, they got it made. I work just as fucking hard and I get shit. It was quick. I felt it was best. I don't consider shit I do a crime, man. It's just life. Shit I gotta do. Like, where we gonna go? You act like we live in Bel Air or something. Yeah. Like, we could That's just, the hood. The like, hood we could just right, go right. in mansions and all that. The hood like is no other way like but, the, but the do crimes. Look where I'm at. This is the hood. This guy ain't got no choice. I'm either gonna fight or I'm either go down. So I'm gonna do what I gotta do. Look where the fuck I live. It made me. I didn't choose this shit. It's just me. This is what, this is what the neighborhood did to me. Shit, I grew up like this. I was born like this, man. Imagine. <laughs> Come on, a dude can't survive off a McDonald's check, a Burger King check. Niggas ain't trying to give no jobs out there. Niggas gotta do something, so, you know, survive with the fittest. It was easy, it was quick. I got away with a lot of shit. Especially you got kids? Come on, man. You gotta eat, man. You gotta get a dollar. What the fuck you gonna do? You know, I'm trying to keep going, get the bread. I'm on, I'm on a paper chase, as you can see. Word, word. Man, trying to get that money. Everybody out here living life of crime, just different ways, you know what I mean? You got your blue collar motherfuckers, go to work, steal checks and shit from people. I don't do that punk ass shit, I rob you straight, you know what I mean? I don't do no checkbook punk ass shit, I'm gonna rob you, I'm gonna take what's in your fucking pocket. Like I had somebody say to me one time that I'm always scheming, I always got a scheme going on. But if anybody knows anything about life in general and about the way people get money, even legitimate, supposedly legitimate people, there's always some, some underlying crime going on. I was born in the hood, born in, in, in Brooklyn right here. You know what I'm saying, and my parents unfortunately didn't have the dough to do the things that I wanted to do. I ain't really had no foggy figures, so I looked at the big homies at my father, you know what I'm saying? They put me on to how you supposed to live a life in these streets. You watch television, you watch shit around you, and you can't really have the things that you see over there. So the streets was like a second father to me. It showed me how to get money. Just waking up in the morning, walking out your crib, that's a crime. What if people cheat on their taxes. People cheat, cheat in, in a lot of ways. People commit crimes in a lot of different ways. I live every day just to get to the next day. So whatever I gotta do to get there, I do what I gotta do. I'm just trying to eat, man. Certain instances, crime pays. That's a real stupid question. See this little nigga walking down here. We about to rob this nigga live TV. You know what I'm saying? Show y'all niggas how the fuck it really goes down. All right. I follow me, my nigga. Shoot, man. Don't shoot. You yeah, got money, money, money in my wallet. I got money in my wallet, man. Don't shoot, y'all. I got money in my wallet. Take the so, wallet. Don't shoot me, please. So funny. Don't shoot me. I got money in my wallet, y'all. Don't shoot, y'all. I got kids at home, y'all. Don't shoot. Yeah, yeah, take the grocery, man. Just come from grocery shopping. Take the grocery. Kneel down. Kneel down, my nigga. Just stay there. Don't fucking scream or nothing. I'll shoot you, nigga. Real talk. Just stay there, all right? What do I think of the police? Those are my arch nemesis, man. They stopping my motherfucking money. What should I think of them? Fuck them. Yo, man, fuck the cops, man. Fuck them crackers, ass police, them pig ass motherfucker. They dirty, man. Fuck the police. Fuck them. Fuck the law. We raw. Fuck them. Fuck the cops, tell you the truth. Fuck the police, man. I don't like the police. Police don't like me. Why am I like them? They should go arrest a priest or something. Fuck them. Fuck every last motherfucking cop out here. The niggas that be walking around in blue and white. The DTs, they can all suck my dick. I don't really think about the police, you know what I mean? 
that's what I think about them. I don't think anything of them. I can go fuck about them. They ain't locking me up. I'm good. They ain't from where I'm from. They don't understand why the fuck we do what we do. You know what I'm saying? And to me, cops is just a regular dude. Police just next motherfucker that got a job. I try to stay away from them. I try to avoid them. Like, they, I got a job to do, they got a job to do. You know what I'm saying? I don't feel no way about them except when they come fucking with me. They got their job, they got to do what they got to do. It's the dickhead police. Niggas was like some fucking pussy ass. Heard niggas in high school used to get smacked up and shit. Now all of a sudden they got a little fucking badge and shit. You know what I mean? Niggas is gangsters. I'm just trying to get by. Motherfuckers that act like you shoving keys or whatever and you just trying to get by. Yeah, that's why I don't be saying my name and all that. That's why they be no. <laughs> They be really knowing me, they be for super shit, dumb shit, like, fuck you long, what I'm, how long I'm gonna do for three down, what the fuck is three down? That fuck with you every day for no fucking reason, you know what I mean, those are the ones that I despise, fuck me. Scumbag. Next time, I'm about to chill out, baby, I'm about to flip, baby. I said they make a right, I'm going to left. I feel like the niggas looking at me too hard, I'm gone, I'm off the scene. Right. But when they leave, I'll be back again. I don't want to see him. Stay away from him, because I don't want to get caught. They everywhere now. You can't even eat. Can't provide for your family nowadays. Some niggas out there doing the same shit too, extorting niggas. So you feel me? Niggas gotta do the same shit too. We on the same thing. Plant shit on people, man. Talk to little girls, man. These motherfuckers ignorant. They dirty out here. They do them. I do me. You no, know, that's life, baby. Work. <laughs> Most of them in school. They got me out of trouble. <laughs> when they just want, you know, out there in the street doing their job, doing what they gotta do, they fine with me. I don't have a problem with them until they fucking with me. But when I say fuck the police, I ain't really talking about every one of them, you know what I mean? I'm talking about the ones that want to fuck with us. <laughs> I'm saying, but the ones that want to act up, fuck them. They came to my crib and scooped me up for, not, for, for, for a robbery I ain't never do. You feel me? Y'all ain't got no warrant. But they do got people that got to do these jobs, then they got fuck niggas that shoot you up. You know what I mean? Just because they prejudiced or they scared of his hood. My homeboy just got killed over some police shit. And they killed my friend over there, you know about it, little Mingo, you feel me? Got shot like last year, you feel me? From the cops, had his hands up, shot him in his neck. Them niggas hitting niggas up. Them niggas right there, them niggas is hitting niggas up. Yeah. Them, them good the hot boys, boys. they shoot niggas up. Boys, good cops, bad cops. Fuck them all over. They don't care about no warrant nowadays. So we don't fuck with the police. If you my fucking cousin, you turn police, nigga. You fucking enemy. Yeah, I jumped out the fire escape. They caught me on a roof. I was gone though. They had to catch me on a roof. I ain't trying to. They gotta, they gotta come and get me. I ain't trying to sit there and get cuffed. They gonna have to come get me. People aren't scared of me. I hang out in the parking lot. Buy a bank machine. Nobody worries. And I see the right person come up. It's easy. The fucking best thing is college girls. They're away from daddy. Going up, getting money out, away from home for the first time. They're not paying attention to me. Nobody thinks I'm there for any reason. I'll be honest. Watch this. Easy target. <laughs> Loser, he got fucking anything in here. Hey, reading glasses. Yeah, sunglasses. I look good in these. Shit, there's nothing. iPod. I'll get something for this. Somebody come out. Somebody come out. Shit, get money, hit licks, what all, what all, set motherfuckers up. You know what I'm saying? I got bitches down with the action, so. You know what I'm saying? I'm with it, whatever, get a green dollar, you feel me? I'm there with the robbery, everything. Trey A, 357, don't matter, as long as it go bang. I gotta be that fucking, that Logan 9. Oh, you know, a little 380. The club papa. When I bust that when I bust that gun, motherfuckers heard it. They would think it was something much bigger than what it was. And and being that it was a 380, it was easy to conceal. So it was to me it was a perfect gun. Now. It was a 380. 
this little small something that we got, you know what I mean? But, I mean, we, we strapped up, man. We all types of guns, man. Yo, man, first you asked me to trash about the police. Now you asked about my gun. Yo, man, what's, what's up with this, man? You police? There ain't no police, right? Nif Millimet shotgun. That's a good gun. Man, I use choppers, guns, gauges, pumps, AK, AR-15s, whatever. Gun. <laughs> I don't deal with no guns, man. I don't, man, I ain't mean I fall back, man. I don't even mess with them things no more. The Goonies, they out here. Well, we trying to talk to them, you know what I'm saying? So right. Goonies out here. I don't think it's crazy. That thing away, man. Come on, all that. Man. I like that fucking Desi, son. That fucking real monster. Shit tear a nigga dome off real quick. Ain't no talk back after that. All type of guns. I'm saying guns is guns. Niggas don't ever go anywhere without guns. You know what I'm saying? Guns is guns. Who gives a fuck? No jokes over here, man. Big guns. AKs, AKs choppers. You know what I'm saying? My boy from down south, so you know we get them premium out the box things come up here. Text 9s, 4s, 5s, 22s, Dillinger's, 38s, you feel me? Little shits like that, you feel me? Get those in the hood. This might make come throughs, hustling back in the days. Yo, got son. Hit you off or something. When I do my thing, I pull out that fucking Devi real quick, man. Niggas fucking, they don't stall like that, you know what I mean? I don't even really let them feel them. Let it get a little quick. And then they be like, oh shit, that's all they need to see. The big ass fucking gun, what you don't see? I need to wipe some of these bullets off. <laughs> they, I think, you know what I'm saying? I done touched a couple of them. I don't want to touch no more, you did. I use what I gotta use at the time, you know what I mean? When the time was right. Yo, man, I fucking give it to a nigga real quick, man. You roll? Huh? Hmm? You roll? Yeah, I'm rolling. Yeah. Nah, you're coming right now. You're coming right now. Get out the fuck out of the car, man. Get the fuck out of the car. I'm fucking do it, man. I gotta get the fuck out of here now. I gotta get the fuck up out of here. Oh shit, this nigga ballin'. Got an iPhone. iPhone, call my bitch, yo. Shit, make sure the boy ain't on us. Fuck this nigga with some bullshit. Yeah, man, I've been a victim of crime, that's why I turned to it. The nigga got me, so I had to go get somebody else. The minute I wake up, the color of my skin, the, the, the ways of my tats, my hair, all that makes me a victim every day. Hell yeah, I've been a victim of crime, man. I live in motherfucking Brooklyn, New York, man, crime central, so of course I've been a victim of crime. Nobody looks at me and says, that guy's got money. I know what I look for. I make sure I don't look like that. Nah, nah, that's one thing, nothing never happened to me. I've never been robbed, raped, none of that. I'm, I'm good. Even the thuggest thug is a victim of crime, you feel me? The biggest kingpin, victim of crime. A lot of people, you know what I mean? Big dogs, victim of crime. You ain't never saved, baby. I've ever been a victim of crime. Let me tell you a true story. This shit happened to me. Where's the bar? Uh, a week and a half ago. You know what I mean? First time ever. I thought I was invincible to this shit. You know what I mean? I got stuck the fuck up. Kicked in my door, took my little stash box. You know what I'm saying? A little cup of, cup of work, some work or whatever. Niggas ran up in there with the burners and caught me. Straight sleeping. I don't care who you is, you ain't bulletproof, man. Unless you got a bunch of police around you 24 hours a day. And even presidents get sniped. ADT don't work for me, man. For real. I done cut them wives in your crib. They got your kids tied up. They got your fucking moms crying. I got stuck up in my mom's crib, sleeping in the bed. She don't know shit. I smacked that bitch the gun. She start talking. She knows something, man. They always know something. Don't leave them at home alone, man. When I was young, I seen my moms get robbed, and I was like, oh, shit. That nigga just got a chain from, you know what I mean? So I was like, fuck that. 
I'ma start doing that shit to the other niggas' moms. She better know where the fucking Devi at, nigga. I got caught slipping, I was sleeping, I had pants down and all that. I woke up, niggas caught me while I was asleep. When I woke up, nigga had my pants in his hand and the burner in the next hand. What the fuck am I supposed to do? But shit, that's life, you know what I'm saying? Fuck it. That's how we eat. I mean, I had to make a joke out of it in order to calm me down. Shit happened to me, I'm a fucking, know what I mean, reciprocate the love, know what I mean, doing to others. They doing to you. That's Bible shit, man. What to say, the world is round. What comes around goes around. I just kept going. Y'all be telling me about that Bible shit. That's biblical shit, nigga. Know what I mean, nigga rob me, I'ma rob him. That's shit. We out here living life like that. Don't don't expect you the biggest, baddest nigga out here. A nigga gonna look, nigga gonna watch you like a next nigga watch you because you got that shit. If you if you walking looking like you flash or whatever. Nigga gotta know how to watch they back out here, man. And I swear to you right now, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm still hunting. I'm like I'm like the feds on this shit right now, so I'm hunting. If I get any little piece of anything. Me and my Debbie gonna be living good, nigga. Living good. They up there making motherfucking music. These niggas is lame. Shit bumping, my nigga. You don't rob these niggas, though. That shit bumping. Fuck these niggas. That shit high right there. Oh shit, son. Oh, what up, son? Oh, how you get it, man? No joking. Damn, man, I'm slipping. Yo, what's this right here, man? Nah, that's my son. You know, he just you get some at the camera, bro. You know, you know we about to be movie stars and yeah, all that. Like, movie stars. Hollywood. Really? Yo, you're like, you know, your nah, business ain't nothing, son. Y'all niggas need to promote that them beats, y'all. Beats, son. You DVD right here? That's your man? Yeah. I was told you the next Just Blaze and all that. You the next Just Blaze, homie? Next just blaze, son. It's the next just blaze right there. That's what it is. Dude, what the what the fuck, son? Oh. Yo, turn that off. 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 Yeah, man, you turn this off. This how we hit, man. Get on the floor. Get on the floor. Are you serious? Get on. Get on the floor. Get on the floor. Dude. Simple and sweet, simple. Hey yo, Jay, what's poppin', man? As long as your pockets ain't cheap, you won't see the red meat. Simple and sweet. Simple and sweet. Real simple, son. Yo, Jay, man, you my peoples, man. What the fuck is this? I don't even want your money in your pockets, man. That's bullshit. So I know it's this sweet, son. Where's that? Ice cream. Where's that? Ice cream. Where's that, man? Where's no, that? We came here to see a business. Oh, they got a phone, son. That's that new stash right there, man. To stash right there. Take the stash. Whoa, man. Take all that. Take all that. Ten years, man. Ten years, man. This nigga is retarded. This nigga is crazy. Yo, let's take it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, man. Don't even move. Don't even move, man. Don't even move. Oh, this shit don't work. Oh. <laughs> I laid there, they walked on out easy. You know what I mean? They got what they got. Them little jewels. That's why I'm naked right now. You know what I mean? Boom, they got my little jewels and a little cash I had in my pocket. You know what I mean? My phone. If a nigga caught me, what can I say? All I can say is, damn, he got me. I just got to get back on my grind. Same thing with that nigga I get. What type of people you like to rob? All types of people. So what kind of people I like to rob? Well, rich people, if that's the case. The fuck? I ain't trying to rob a broke nigga. If a nigga broke like me, what the fuck I'm robbing him for? I look for the easy things. If it looks too tough, I just slide away. Watch 
this. It's like nothing. One time, they tried to rob me for my chain and shit. I was in the Bronx. They tried to come at me with a little gun and all that. Know what I mean, but you gonna rob me? Gotta be tough. You can't be like on some old yo. Give me your chain, please. You gotta like, really be aggressive. Take nigga chain. You, nigga try to took me out of my chain. Like I'm saying, all right, you're right. Nah, nigga. So know what I mean, I took him out of the shit. Know what I mean, skated on him. I'm the type of nigga. I'm a predator. I look for the motherfucking weak motherfucker. Know what I'm saying, with his arm like this. Know what I'm saying, the dying animal, just there crying for help. That's what I look for. Trying to rob the nigga that got more than me. But realistic talk, I ain't gonna lie. The best thing is to rob is other drug dealers. Um, but I'm sure I don't live more than my big son in you. Cause at the end of the day, them niggas can't say shit. I'm gonna put a metier in the house, metier on couch, in the head of the egg, and I'm gonna put a gasoline on the head, and I'm gonna put a gasoline on the head, and I'm gonna Where's the lighter? I don't know. It doesn't seem to want to work. Oh, he's got these fucking chili peppers. I think his first robbery. He was a, he's a rookie. This nigga didn't know who he was fucking doing. Niggas, I mean, trying to yell, son, give me a chain, please. Nah, nigga, you need to be more aggressive. You want to take a nigga chain, you want to go up there, give me that fucking chain. You'll be like, yo, son, that shit is shining. Nah, nigga, he's too smooth with it. First day, rookie. Hey. Oh. <laughs> hey, I can do something like this. You know, certain things that, you know, if it ain't in your nature, it's like, I was never a stick-up kid. I would have never made a, a good stick-up kid, so I never did it. You know, I never stuck people up, because that wasn't me. You know what I'm saying? I did what I knew I could do and, and that, 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 what I felt comfortable doing. Oh, look at this. It's nice. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, that Happy Halloween, motherfucker. That's my best shit right there. I'm going through in the club, see a nigga shining, you feel me? Catch the nigga in the whip, you know, extort everybody in the whip. That's it, bitches, whoever, I don't give a fuck. Holy shit. I thought my place sucked. Jeez. Yeah, nigga. Get the wash now, motherfucker. You won't get this wash, motherfucker. Yeah, you bitch ass nigga. Hey, Swiss Army, what do you think? Look good on me? I see somebody in the nights. It depends on the spot. If I see you somewhere that's sweet, I don't give a fuck if you motherfucking Arnold Schwartz nigga, I'm robbing you. It's sweet. I got my gun. I don't gotta worry about nothing. <laughs> Smile! <laughs> You making me famous or so I'd have robbed you, know what I mean? Cause I like that camera, that shit nice, you know what I mean? But but you gonna make me famous. You you probably gonna make me stop doing right, this shit. Right, right, left? Yeah. What y'all doing, making a movie or something? It's three blocks of bed for the street. Hey, yo, up, chill. Hold up, hold up, oh, shit, block. yo, chill. chill. I don't got nothing, man. I don't got nothing, man. Chill. Chill. I don't got nothing, man. Get in the car. Get in the car. Chill. Chill, man. Yo, chill. All right, man. I'm sorry. Yo, I got money. Let me get the money. Right, chill. I don't got the money. Here, man. Here, that's all I got, yo. That's all I got, man. Chill. I know you got I don't got nothing. You ain't walking out here with no ID. 
Go to school, that's how I used to get money. Started robbing niggas for their lunch money and shit, you know what I mean? They used to want to smoke weed and shit. Y'all niggas know, I used to take your weed. I'd rather get a bag of weed, you know what I'm saying? It's freestyle on some shit, they could get on the block. Yeah, hey, I did the school thing. Tried it, been there, done it, you know what I mean? Mostly high. Stay niggas weed, stay high, get a little change in my pocket, it's all good. That's what I started at. School is cool, it's bitches in school. So at the end of the day, school is cool. School, school is great, man. I love the girls in school. I push for these young motherfuckers to go to school. Because school no, 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 teach you kids. how to break up the things that we break up. It show you the mathematics of what we doing. I didn't have prep schools and college. Daddy gave me a car at 16. And they got mad dudes out there with degrees and still ain't getting shit. Niggas ain't giving no jobs like that. No mad dudes with degrees and no, I ain't, I ain't getting nothing. The intelligence will keep you out of jail, keep you from getting killed too. I graduated from high school and all that shit, and I feel like if I could do it, anybody could do it. Cause I went through hell, niggas tried to kill me my senior year. You might not see me in school, but I pick up a book and I read, man. I read a lot of things, man. I, I suggest that everybody learn as much as they possibly can, but you don't necessarily have to go to school to do that. But I suggest that everybody learns as much as they can to know as much as you can about the streets, about life in general, because uh, the more you know, the more options you, you have, the more choices you have, the more things that you are able to do and accomplish. Judge a book by a cover, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Read a lot of books. That's the only way you're gonna survive. Even though I'm out in the street doing my thing, I know a lot of shit, and that's what allows me to be out in the street and make money the way that I do. I know all different types of things, all different types of ways to get money, because I learned these things, you know what I'm saying? I kicked out of school, did all of that shit, you know what I'm saying? Schooling for a nigga like me. I fought through it, you know what I mean? Niggas wanna, niggas wanna get at it, we gonna get at it. Everything you learn out in the street ain't negative and it ain't all good. You know, nothing's all good and nothing's all bad, but it's always best to have as much intelligence as possible. Stay, stay in fucking time. school, else you're gonna meet a nigga like me. Man, I do got a nine to five. That's on the block. Got a nine to five. I do anything, baby, man. It's hard work, you heard? This ain't no game, man. I had a fucking nine to five. Working some shitty warehouse. Well, I did catch a nine to five, man. It sucked. I be getting money on the block all day. I make more dough on the block. Work as fucking hard as anybody else. And I get shit for it. Yeah, man, nine to five don't want me, man. I tried that. <laughs> You know what? I tried that shit once. And at the end of the day, I can't listen to nobody tell me what to do. 9 to 5 is? You know, everything's fair for a square. I'm supposed to go to work, break my back, climb up in the motherfucking ceiling of a construction building, flip flapjacks, burn my hands up and shit. I could do that, but like I have a lot of uh, things going on in my life, a lot of things that I've done in the past that I wouldn't make the kind of money that I can doing. The things that I do, scheming and you know, doing some of the things that I do. Okay, you like shit. Treat you like shit. Some people, some people can do it, some people can't, man. 
It's all about patience. Because when you're in the streets, the streets build you like a soldier. So when you go to like the corporate America and there ain't no soldiers there, it's like the world ain't the same. The two worlds don't mix. And even $15 an hour, man, I sell like fucking three spliffs in like a half a minute and get that. I, I, I done been there, been on my knees with this job. Man, only time I'm, I'm, I'm working, that paycheck gotta be lovely, you heard? Nobody's gonna pay me what I want. I'm an old G, you know. I'm like almost 50 years old, and ain't nobody gonna pay me the kind of money that I'm worth. They don't want me, man. They look at me right away. Nah, man, we're not hiring. They seen a big fire and sell outside, dog. You don't wanna hire me for what? Fuck you too. That's why I do what I do. Same niggas I get. I get their money. Fuck it. The warehouse closes. I'm tired of that shit. They don't even want you there. Assholes trying to keep their thumb on you. Niggas ain't trying to give no jobs out there. I'm trying to work a nine to five. I work, you know what I'm saying? I do, I do a nine to five, it's nothing, you know what I mean? But, you know, I only work for like, probably like a couple months, just so I can pay Uncle Sam that tax so they don't give you that motherfucking tax evasion law. I'd rather get the street money. I ain't gotta pay no taxes, fuck with the IRS and all that other shit. I'm gonna fucking eat off these motherfuckers that's out here. The George Bushes and the motherfucking Mark Markowitz and the fucking all these do, you know what I mean? Those are the criminals. They rob us every fucking day. Taxes, what the fuck you think that is? That's fucking robbery, man. What's the government gonna go do? Go blow up people? I gotta own my own, man, for real. I gotta be my, my own boss. I gotta boss my my situation, you know? I don't need no daily job right now. I'm doing good how I'm eating, so this is how I'm eating right now, so they gotta respect my hustle, you feel me? And I get my money dirty, man. Fuck, fuck that. They can't. Yo, man, we out here a lot now, man. You know I gotta lay low after that shit that happened yesterday, you know what I mean? You know how I do, I ain't stupid, you know what I mean? Out in the city, hot and shit now. Got a little cut, a little freshen up, different area, you know what I'm saying? Fucking girl got me out here, man. Broke as hell, you know what I mean? Chopped that thing up, a little bit of paper, man. I ain't getting no real money off that shit, man. It's something to eat for the night, you know what I mean? Like I said, feed my daughter. Man. Out here walking. I'm tired of fucking walking, man. I think niggas need a fucking ride, man. Crocker ass lamb. All these fucking big ass cars out here. I think I need to get me a ride today, man. Give me something nice, man. Should I have, man? I should I? Right. Nigga thought he was doing it, you know. He is doing it. I'm doing it too now. Change for a dollar? Yeah, you know what it is, man. Back up from the car, man. Back up, man. Back up. Move from the car, man. Move the fucking car, man. Drive a fucking seven. Fucking ass nigga like that driving a seven. Why can't I drive a seven? That's why I got me a seven now, man. Fucking nigga, man. Come on, man, move. Move, man, move. Move. Fuck out of here, gotta get the fuck out of here, man. Crack the ass land. Gotta get mine, gotta eat, man. Fuck that shit. Told you, nigga saw that Devi. Saw that Devi, back the fuck up. Back the fuck up, see that Devi, boy. Told you, gotta get the fuck out of here now. Really, I'm really not gonna answer that, honestly. Things like that we can't speak upon, baby. That's like real personal. Like that's like the other question you ask. You feel me? We gotta skip and go to the next question. <laughs> Be honest with you, homie. I'm gonna plead the fifth because that's what school taught me. See how school's cool? <laughs> I'm gonna plead the fifth on that statement because I, I feel like I'm on. I feel right. On, I feel like I'm on a bench. Not yet. Smart. I don't think anybody that has any kind of sense, and that goes back to learning and having intelligence, wants to kill anybody.
Yeah, I killed somebody, man. I done killed mad people, man. Them niggas know me. Don't fuck with Fat Boy. Don't fuck with my money. Better give it up. You gotta ask yourself in your heart, is it really worth spending your life in jail? Mmm. Can't say right now, what I'm saying. I did my little dirt back in the day. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Shh, don't say too much, you know what I'm saying? I'm keep that low. I ain't catch no deaths or nothing, but somebody was in the hospital in a coma for a couple of days. Pour bientôt. I'm not tired, but I'm not going to be a neck. I'm not going to be a neck. I'm not going to be a I ain't even going to speak upon that too tough, you know what I'm saying? I ain't the you know, one to be talking about all that crazy, ah, rah, rah, do this, ah, ah, ah. You know, I'm out here. I saw you really need to know, though. I'm out here. Ha! Man behind the mask, bro. If somebody was to rape my mother or my sister or something like that, the police better get to him before I do because when I get to him, I'm going to kill him. Straight like a while ago, it was crazy. When? Um, like, I was upstairs playing with my cousins, and I heard, boom, boom. Jeez, shit, boy. Yeah. Is this nigga Diddy bopping right yeah. here, son? Yeah. I see this black nigga Diddy bopping, son. Burger yeah. my mother. Yo, Miff, faggot. Shit, man. Total was it a game, son? Down. What did even happen? Don't pass the shorts, I said boom, boom, and it said. I've been locked up. You? Ha. That's not a place I want to go. Yeah, I serve time. Um, actually, to be honest, it's like my longest stretch out on the streets. Never got caught. I ain't never did no motherfucking time, know what I'm saying? Which actually means that I'm good at what I fucking do. At prison shit, realistically, it don't matter. Because it's all in your mind. So at the end of the day, if I've been to the jail system, I was still good. Did a lot of skit bitch work. Learn a lot off of it too, you heard? I'm one of them fortunate niggas that I was lucky enough, I never did get caught. You know, I done a lot of shit I should have did time for, and I just was fortunate that I never did caught. But see, that goes back to being intelligent and having sense and knowing when to, to step back from something, you know, and, and, and knowing what things not to deal with and what things to deal with. Yeah, I did some time, you know what I'm saying? I did time, done time, now I'm on the block. I did 10 years, you know, it was, it was rough, man, it was rough. It was like a jungle, man, you had to fend. No, I'm not going to do that. It's very difficult for you to camp in my name. That little miniature bit, it was nothing. There's no place I'm trying to go back to, so that's another reason why I'm trying to get up out here. Niggas come out criminal mess to fucking minds, because you spend a mad time with a bunch of criminals that's like the top of their craft, you know what I mean? So that jail shit is like motherfucking college for some niggas, you know what I mean? Doing a four-year stretch, come out and get shit popping. I done been there, done that. You no, know, I'm trying to stay out. I'm out here. That's what I'm worried about. How it is in there? It made me see life from a different perspective. You know, it, it made me realize that life was precious. <laughs> How it is in there? Hey, you gotta survive. <laughs> prison ain't really nothing. To me, if, if you fall under that prison state mind, it's because you was a bitch ass nigga anyways. Prison ain't shit, man. Not for a nigga like me. It could be the toughest motherfucker from the streets go up in there, but he get his, his motherfucking food ate. That's when you're gonna see who the real man that could be the softest nigga in the streets and make it home straight. Prison ain't no difference than the streets. It's a jungle anywhere you go. That's when you really gonna learn how to be a man. A lot of dudes be running around this street thinking it's sweet. Yeah, we out here. Uh, it's because we, you out here, it's a lot of freedom, you heard? And when you back there, when you, when you locked up, when you in that jungle, baby, you heard? <laughs> Ain't no running, no hiding. You gotta do you, baby. Do you. You go to prison, whatever happened in there is gonna happen the same way out here. It's you as you. You know what I'm saying? If you change up in there, then you was never you. You ever witnessing crime out here? How, how it is? Crime? It happens once in a while. You know, it comes and goes. You know, it's just ordinary street thing, man, you know? How's 
I witness, you know what I mean, motherfuckers just getting, getting lit right up. It was almost me. It just so happened that the nigga walked out the gate before I did. And he caught it. All that that, that stuck in my brain for a lot of years. And the way he moaned and groaned and that shit burned his motherfucking brain. And I see the little fragments in, you know what I mean, in the streets on the curb. I swore to never, ever, ever, ever go out like that from that day on. Some niggas don't even make it to see like 15. Shit's crazy. It's getting smoked out here in the battlefield. I passed the statistics, you know what I mean? And I've been in these streets. I'm 31 years old. I, when I was fucking 17, you know what I mean? I thought I, I never thought I'd make it to 18. Fuck off, man. When I was 18, I told my mother I won't make it to 21. I ain't gonna say I'm lucky, but I just know how to make it through. I'm a little smarter than a lot of other motherfuckers. I've been shot. Wasn't meant for me. Almost bled to death. But I survived. Wasn't my time to go. Yeah, fam, listen, boy. Yo, yo, let's go, man. Okay. Yeah. Come on, D up, nigga. Fuck out of here. Tough up. Tough enough. Tough up, yo. Shit pop off out here. When I say pop off, pop off. Welcome to Eye to Eye. Rapper Cameron has made millions from his lyrics about life in the mean streets of Harlem. And a big part of his hip-hop culture is keeping your mouth shut when the cops come around. He told CNN's Anderson Cooper on 60 Minutes why he'd rather be silent than a snitch. There's this thing about snitching. And I want to get to that because I, I th I've been thinking about this for a while. And, and it needs an OG to talk about. Is there any situation where you think it's okay to talk to the police? Yeah, definitely. Say hello, how you feel, everything all right, period. When I was coming up, it applied to me and my boys. When we did a crime together, if one of us get busted, we didn't tell on the other one. If you had seen who shot you, would you have told police? No. Somebody does something with somebody in your family, you ain't gonna snitch. All right, if you ain't gonna snitch, then that means that you have to get at that nigga. Whoever did that to that person, you have to get him. I was raised differently not to tell. You didn't snitch because you didn't want the police to get him because you wanted to get him. It wasn't you didn't, you didn't snitch because you just didn't want to tell. A lot of people, though, hearing that are going to say that that's not a good thing. The people that say it's not a good thing are most likely the people that don't buy my record. Snitching ain't for, it's for a criminal. If you ain't a criminal, then that shit don't snitch, don't apply to you. It does not apply to you. No little nigga in the street that ain't that ain't doing no 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 criminal activity should be talking about I ain't snitching. You ain't got nothing to snitch about. What the fuck are you talking about? If there's a serial killer living next door to you though, and you know that person is, you know, killing people, would you be a snitch if you called police and told 
I recently seen an interview where this cat Cameron said if he had, if he lived next door a serial killer that he wouldn't tell the police. He would just move away. If I knew the serial killer was living next door to me, yeah. no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't call and tell anybody on him. But I probably move. So what is he saying that he don't give a fuck about you or me? That that serial killer could kill your mother, my mother, and he ain't gonna say nothing. I'm not gonna be around because. I don't need to be living around serial killers, but I'm not gonna call and be like, put the signs up like, yo, you know, the serial killers in 4E. That motherfucker's out of his mind. So for you, it's it's really about business. It's about business, but it's still also a code of ethics. What he really should have said is, he said, he said, if I knew a serial killer was living next door to me, I'm gonna get my boys and we gonna go over there and, and take care of that motherfucker. Okay, I can understand you don't wanna call the pop cops on them, but you need to go over there and take care of them because next, that motherfucker might kill somebody in your family. It's like I said, I'm raised from where we wasn't raised to tell. You don't let nobody come in, in your community and do anything to anybody that you know to your family or any of your friends' family and don't do nothing about it. You better snitch or if you don't snitch, you better get at that nigga whoever did it. You wasn't brought up to say, hey, this guy did that, this guy did that. It's kind of like not saying go do something bad to the person who did something to you, but it's kind of police in your own community. If you don't do nothing about it, they're going to come back and do it again. You know what I'm saying? They're going to think it's all right to just come to your household, to your to your block or whatever, and do whatever the fuck they want to do because you ain't going to snitch, and then you ain't going to do nothing about it either. It's not your responsibility. Exactly. Motherfuckers got that I ain't snitching shit twisted. It goes for, that's a criminal code, and it's meant for criminals, and if you ain't no criminal, then that's, I don't snitch, no, don't snitch, don't apply to you. You know what I'm saying? Trust me. One little fucking smart. I ain't go fucking college. But I know how to be smart. This guy's on vacation. I know he's my aunt. Nah. I got sources. He's fucking gone. I can do like fucking anything I want. Easy. That's the way to do it. The lights is off. <laughs> he needs to take care of his house. You know what? I'll take care of it for him. Cowboy, what do you think? Ah, too small. Ah, nice. I could live here. Trick or treat. Beware the burglar is breaking into your house. You think we should have you up? No one's here. No one's coming home.
Think it looks good on me? <laughs> I could probably use it as a ring. <laughs> it's too small though. <laughs> What do you think? Look natural? What the hell is he shopping there for? There's all this shit out Alright, somebody lives here. What the hell is this thing? Wireless. I don't know, whatever the hell it is, I gotta take it. Shit, I ain't gonna need like a fucking tractor trailer to clean this place out. Oh fuck. Rolex. Nice. Halloween treat for me, man. Don't be amazed how many assholes think they put stuff underneath their bed. Yeah, what's this? Holy shit. Damn. <laughs> Score! <laughs> Use the bank, asshole! <laughs> This guy's got to just leave shit like this in his house. God damn. Alright. This night's getting better and better. Let's see what else we can find around this place. It's fucking Picasso. Alright, it's not the cue ball, that's a ball. You'll not be getting my booty! because it's well hidden in a chest buried in the yard. I shouldn't leave that laundry like that. Hey, I wonder if I can meet her. Ah. Oh, nice. <laughs> I haven't seen a leather jacket. He's gotta have a leather jacket. Wait, I have to I have to ride with a hook. Ah it's the Halloween hook man! What do you think? Can I be a racer? Alright. Now we'll see what kind of golf game I got. Oh shit! Oh, look at this shit. This is nice. Alright, he's got a little chip there. We'll have to deal with that. Damn. Damn. Look at the wheels! Mm, nice. What do you think? This is the best shit I've seen in the house so far. Not fucking locked. <laughs> Oh, this thing's beautiful. Let's see how I fit in it. Oh man, this is right. This is what I should be driving. Got keys anywhere? Oh, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Switchblade key. Ah. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Nice. What's that? Oh shit. Oh shit. What do you think? Oh. This. This. This is my ride. You got the K? 
cash? You know what? You got the cash? I got cash. Let's get out of here. I got spending money. I think it's time for a little, ri little ride, a little fun. Lift off. Wanna go for a ride? I love my home. It's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, man. You know you always want to stop. Got a little girl and shit. But you know what? She got to eat. When you say stop, do you mean like stop living or stop what? Like, break it down to me. It's going to be a day for that. When I die. Ever stop in this life? No. Not stopping. That can't, that can't ever happen because that, that'd be stop being me. I, I do life for the street, man, you know. Hang out, you know, do what I do, man. When the time comes to stop, you're going to know it. I always think about it, but like I said, this street, these streets, it's, it's nothing but negativity around here. I'm not going to try anymore. I just take it. I've been in these streets too long. I'm never going to catch up with all those people on top. I got everything growing up. I didn't get shit. I'm forever going to smoke weed. I'm forever going to do what I do. Right, when I get my bread, I'm gonna get it. I've been taught street life, so this is what it is. Can't stop being me, homie. At the end of the day, I'm me. I'm saying the streets is what raised me, streets is what hold me, and streets is gonna continue to be me. Either it's gonna get too hot, too flamey, or either you're gonna get that ding in your head, you feel me? I'm back on it. It's good, man. Like, you know, it's the same thing for the bomb lumière for me to get out of my life. This life is forever. It's like. Until I'm comfortable, it's like, I'm good, man. Until dudes stop tripping, I'm good, man, you know? I'm just taken from people that got it. They got so much shit, they don't know what to do with it. I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop for a good reason. Stop at the right time, too. Yeah. What it do, my peoples? We live on 44th and Broadway. Time, motherfuckers. Y'all know what goes on out here. Bright lights, big city. I'm saying, you know somebody's out here stunting. They got a little cash on them. So I'm going to try and catch something out here. Not even try. I'm going to catch something out here. You know what I mean? Live for y'all to see. I'm about to paint again, man. I'm about to take the brush out and um, do some artwork. So y'all going to see me live, direct. It's a lot of people out here, man. It's looking good. It's about to go down. We're going to do it right here, too. Right here. I'm going to show y'all how easy it is. In the fucking crowd, I'm going to do this shit. It's my Vic. Come on. Do an interview with you for a little minute. We're doing a little show. Come on, camera. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you do it. <laughs>